everybody, it's Karina with Karina Loves to Plan. Welcome back to my channel. So there is my spread for Monday, May 15th through to Sunday, May 20th in my mini happy planner where I use the succulent kit from L Plan. And then I also used a couple of boxes from the Goal Getter sticker book. So this week for Monday, May 21st through to Sunday, May 27th, always take them out of the disc just because it's easier to decorate that way. I will be using this bloom, no, blossom sampler from Green Darner Designs. And then I'll be using some stickers as well from the Colorful Boxes sticker book. Okay, and I'm also gonna do this real time with talking over it as well. Um, I don't know whether it's gonna be something I'm gonna keep doing. Um, if you like the real time with me talking while I'm planning, let me know. If you want me to go back to the sped up with a voiceover, let me know as well. All right, let's get started. Okay, so the first thing I am going to do is place a box. Do I really want to place a box over the Be Brave BU? Because it is such, um, it is a pretty box and it kind of goes with the grays that are already in this. So what I'm going to do as well is first place a box. Do I want a really big box or do I just want this? I think I want a really big box. Woo. Let's place it. Do I want it here, there? I like to place mine right in the center, but I don't want to cover Thursday because I have things that I normally do on the Thursday that require their own list. So, I'm going to ah, use one of these boxes then for my to-do list for Tuesdays. Again, I love boxes. Now, do I want to place them over both days or just maybe I will place it over Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday like that. And then place the sampler over. I'm gonna do this like this. So it kind of overlaps. And then I'm gonna keep that there because I like the look of that. Now I have these washi strips that I feel like would go really well overlapping somehow, but where? Okay, let's leave that to the side for now. And then I'm gonna leave, put this one up here on Friday because I think it's gorgeous. Because even if I put this one here, it wouldn't cover the whole box. So I'm gonna keep that Be Brave Be You. And then there's this, ah, see that's where I'm gonna put this to-do list is on Thursday because I have things that go on on Thursdays that I need a list for. Now, the key thing is, let's see, let's put it down here. I feel like I need it to overlap, not overlap, but layer with something. It's just a matter of what. It's gonna be a very simple spread overall anyway, but it would be nice if I had some deco to go with it. So maybe, I'll put that there. Put this over Saturday and Sunday. And then, doo -doo -doo -doo. what do I wanna do with this one? because I'm inevitably gonna put a box over Saturday and Sunday as well. So maybe we'll leave that for now. And then, ooh, not the gold, but the silver. I must have missed the silver. Okay. I do like, ooh, and you know what? The 27th is gonna be a big day just because we're picking up the U-Haul on that day to start the process of moving moving all of our stuff out of the apartment. And the crazy thing is, we get possession on the same day that we have to move out of our apartment. Unfortunately, that was the only way that we could do it. And so we're gonna try and move our stuff out of the 
apartment first, maybe stay with my parents for a couple of days and then go from there and see what happens. Now, I feel like I should put the washi strip over that to kind of match what's going on on the other side. I'm gonna hate ripping these up. Ugh. Urgh. Slowly. Does anybody else procrastinate when it comes to packing? I wonder if I should just... I am... I was saying to my husband the other day that packing is probably one of my least favorite activities in my entire life. Packing is not something that I would choose to do on a day-to-day -day basis. Um, if I could avoid packing at all costs, I probably would. I'm gonna layer this. I wanna use up every single bit of this kit. No, I don't wanna put that there. So I'm gonna put this here over Thursday and layer the box like this on top. Ah. I kind of think, oh my God. I kind of think when you guys watch the real time with me doing like me chatting while I'm doing this, you kind of get the the unedited version of me. <laughs> you get the, I really don't like that crease, but I'm gonna learn how to live with it. You get the unedited version of me that you don't always see when I do the voiceovers. Putting a to-do list over there, and then I'm gonna put today on this one. I like that they're kind of off center. And then, now I'm gonna put in the little tabs for my work shifts. Unfortunately, there's only four and I need five, but I will make it work. So, let's put a work tabby here. I don't know, work tag, flag, tab whatever they're called. I'm probably the worst one when it comes to the proper names for what stickers are. I, uh, I'm just kind of like, whatever. It's a sticker, it goes in my planner, and it's pretty. That's all that matters, it's pretty. And for Friday the 20th, oh no, that's my death. <laughs> Yeah, this is why I need a planner because at the end of the day, I'm like, when am I working? And then Sunday, I need something for Sunday. So let's just put in the nice planner instead for my work shift on Sunday because those hours haven't actually been confirmed yet, but that's okay. Um, then a little coffee mug for Thursday because we have our coffee dates on Thursdays all the time. And checklists. I think checklists would be good, but I don't necessarily need them. I'm gonna put this this week tab over here with a checklist. I love her sampler kits because they are made exactly for the size that you need your planner to be. Um, let's see. Are Rob and I gonna actually gonna be able to get a date night this week? Maybe, maybe not. And... No, that's a train moving by my house. Was it? <laughs> I live very close to a set of train tracks, so you're gonna hear that quite a bit. Okay. Um, and there's a few like girly things here. I don't know where I would put them, but I would be expecting some happy mail next week, so... Maybe let's put that on Wednesday. And then I've got a couple of these tabs. Ooh. Am I doing anything Friday? Not that I know of as yet. Friday's like a, a typical pick up groceries and then go weigh in at Weight Watchers. So, no, I sometimes leave that. I don't really need these because Saturday and Sunday are gonna be busy packing. But I kinda of wanna keep them just in case. I'm gonna leave this here for now, but it's purple on purple. So I'm gonna leave the, make it green. 
And notice how I'm always putting them off center, just because I like it. And then actually this, I'll leave that as is. And then maybe, yeah, I'll put that there. And then I have a few other things as well. I wonder if, oh! This is why I need a planner because there is something important going on on the 25th. It is the day that we have our two hour inspection of our new house. Wow. <laughs> oh, okay. And then I don't know if I need the purse, but uh, why not? <coughs> <coughs> Another reason why I have done voiceovers in the past is because you don't get to catch me having coughing fits in the background. I'm gonna call this a bit of a date night just because, well, how often do Rob and I get to go out on a date? Um, I don't really, I'm not a big fan of the shoes. I don't know, maybe. Yeah, let's just put them there, just so they're, you know, they're cute. Cool. I think I am done. I've only left behind a couple of the checklists in the next week banner because I don't need them. But otherwise, that is my spread. Thank you guys so much for watching. If you have any questions, please leave them in the comments below. If you like this style of video where I'm doing it real time with the chatty bloopers or whatever it is, let me know. Or if you want me to go back to the sped up with the voiceovers, let me know as well. Thanks again for watching and have yourselves a great day.